Hi everyone, today we're going to have a look at the camel hitch. It's said to have tied up camels, but I'm not sure about that. Either way, it's good for a pull in either direction, and of course perpendicular, and it's easy to untie even when the rope is wet. So we'll start this one off by throwing our rope over our rail, and we're going to take wraps in that direction there, and I'm going to take three wraps. So that's two, and that is a third one, and we just make sure we have enough free rope. I'm going to come across this standing part here, and then I'm going to reverse direction, come in through this hole, I'm going to come in around again in that reverse direction, and come in through that hole. And then if we tighten this up by pulling on both ends that will make the completed camel hitch. And this is actually a pretty good knot to demonstrate that a lot of the more complex knots are just combinations of knots you may already know. So if we look at this section here, just in here, that is a lark's head or cow hitch. And if we look at this section here, just this bit here, that's just a clove hitch. So the way I like to remember how to tie this one is just to take a few wraps, make a cow hitch, make a clove hitch, and your knot's completed.